Hey hoes. So long time no see. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Kenzie. Sorry that you get the closed end of my steering wheel every so often. I'm currently on my way to indoor skydiving. Um, so I'm driving, but let's get back to the intro. For those of you, I'll wait until you can see me. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Kenzie and I'm so happy that you found my channel. Um, give me two seconds to get out. I'm currently staying at an Airbnb with underground parking. Okay. I get the keys to my place um, Saturday. So all of that shebang will be coming soon. But back on topic, I am on my way to indoor skydiving. I am finished flight attendant school. I am fully qualified to fly as a flight attendant now. So my first shift is on Monday. It is currently Wednesday. Um, ever since I moved to Calgary, I've wanted to go indoor skydiving at iFly and it was like my reward for getting through this program because it was hella intense and very, very stressful. So that's what I'm doing. I'm going indoor skydiving right now. New city, new adventures. Um, so yeah, that is what I'm doing. I have a couple of little errands to run today. Um, I'm going to, like I just talked about, I'm going in, indoor skydiving. And then I'm also going to get my nails done. I'm gonna go back to the salon that I don't overly like because I've broken three nails and I left the nail salon with a crooked nail the day I originally got my nails done. Um, but it's close by and it's cheap. So I'm going to go back there because when I move, I'm going to get a new nail salon anyway. So I'm just going to go back there for now. Um, so I'm going to do that. I also have to pick up my uniforms. They got delivered last week. I still haven't picked them up. So I have to do that. And then yeah, tomorrow I'll probably take you around too. I'm going to a gym show tomorrow, crystal show. Um, Friday I'm getting my lashes redone. I got quite the little plan before I move because I move on Saturday. But I need to go because I need to plug in where I'm going um, because I don't know where I'm going. Okay, so I'm here. I'm really, really early. I, um, there's one other person here. Okay, awkward. But I'm really excited, but I'm also really nervous. I was supposed to come with two of my friends um, but things happened and they couldn't come, so I still wanted to go because I was originally planning on going by myself anyway. Um, <laughs> well, if I, well, if I die, you won't be seeing this, so. I don't know, it's indoor skydiving. How dangerous can it really be? Excuse the dirty windshield, but there I am. I'm alive, you guys. It was really, really fun. We actually did two one-minute flies. Um, there's probably eight of us. Um, I went by myself, and everybody else was with a group, but it is what it is. That's what you get for moving to a new city. Um, I'll insert the picture. I look like a... <laughs> like my... Just don't... Ignore the way I look, but I got a picture, so there you go. I'll insert that now. Um, I then ran into Dollarama to fulfill my addiction to Diet Pepsi. I got five one liter Diet Pepsis and um, what else did I get? A cookie and then this is um, water by Gatorade and I didn't realize like I just wanted regular water um, 
It was kiwi strawberry flavored and I took the first sip and I was like, what is this? This tastes like Gatorade. Um, and then I realized it was flavored water. So really good dollar store water. Um, I'm now going to pick up my uniforms. I, I need to stop putting it off. I'm just scared that they're going to deny me because my license doesn't match the address I had it sent to. Um, but we'll see. If not, I guess I just go to work in the same dress because I only have one uniform. Um, and then I'm going to get my nails done because they're looking really ratchet. Two nails broke. But one thing at a time. Let's go pick up uniforms. And that's it. So the company that my work orders their uniforms from, we have to order our own uniforms. Um... Is literally such a pain in the ass because I ordered two dresses and an apron they just sent me the apron so I literally only have the one dress that I already had to work in until they can get their shit together and send me the rest of my order oh, what a piss off Okay, I'm home, hair is up. Um, I'm gonna watch a movie and try to figure out everything with this uniform. I don't know why, I don't know. I'm assuming they were all supposed to be there, but maybe they shipped out in two different orders. I'm not sure, I have to figure that out. I have to, I have to deal with that. But I'm also gonna watch Kidnapping Stella. It has been on my watches for a while now, so I'm gonna watch that. Um. I guess I could tell you what happened last night. So I'll insert the clips that I took. Um, I posted them on my Instagram story. If you're not following me on Instagram, what are you doing? Make sure you follow me. Um, <laughs> that was so cringe. Um, <laughs> Today, the fire alarm in all four buildings of my Airbnb because I'm staying in an Airbnb condo and all four condo buildings um, their fire alarms were going off so we were all standing in the parking lot and it started in our like the building I'm staying in it was a false alarm I should start with that but there was three fire truck pulled up and we were all standing outside and they only went into our building um, but yeah, I didn't even know where the <laughs> I didn't know where the stairs were last night because I've never used them. Um, uh, but yeah, that's my little. That was at eleven o'clock last night. Fun adventure, fun adventure. I fly was super fun. No, I'm just rambling. I fly was fun. I then went to Dollarama, which I forgot my Dollarama bag in the car, so I'll go get that later. Um, it's in the underground parking and then I went to pick up the uniforms which I need to deal with because my first shift is in less than a week. I guess I'm just rotating through the same dress for four days like it's fine not disgusting at all. Um, so I gotta deal with the uniforms and then I got my nails done. I went with this like lilac color. My only thing is is they're not coffin and the thumb is really long. This salon is not good. This salon is not, not good. Um, but they're right by where I'm staying and I'm moving on Saturday. So I was like, I'll go one last time and then I'll be done. And hopefully my new salon will be better. But I'm going to watch this movie, have a snack, figure out the uniforms, 
that's probably my day. Honestly, I'm just gonna be around home for the rest of the night. I might order Denny's later. I've been craving pancakes since my nose surgery and I still have not gotten them. Um, so I might order pancakes from Denny's. It might be a major cheat meal because I really want their cake batter milkshake as well. And if you didn't know, I'm dairy free. Um, but I do have the lactase pills. So take a couple of those and hope for the best. Um, so that might be later. I'll, I'll film if I do decide to order that tonight. If not, I will see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow I am going to the Crystal Show here in Calgary. Um, and there's something else I was going to do tomorrow. I'll remember later, I suppose. Oh, I got to get gas. That's not a, that's not the other thing. Anyway, I will talk to you guys later. They don't love you like I love you. Back up. They don't love you like I love you. He found his dad's porn collection. His dad Tell me this doesn't look the most delicious thing in the world. Where he got it from. And yes, I'm still watching you for you. Hi. <laughs> Good morning, afternoon, whatever it is. It's afternoon here. Um, I am leaving my Airbnb for the first time today. It is 3.30. I'm heading to the Crystal Show. Finally, I spent a good chunk of my morning dealing with like getting power and Wi-Fi and TV and what else did I get? Tenant insurance. Some of these companies are a bitch to get a hold of, like a pain in the ass. You have to contact them online first. And then, anyway, I was literally on hold for like a half hour just to get my power hooked up. And a half hour doesn't seem bad, but when, I won't even get into it, but to summarize, I put my name on the callback list because it was like, it's gonna be 20 minutes. And I was like, okay, well, just call me back. Like, you know, they have the callback feature. They called me back after I had already called back because it had been like an hour and a half and I still hadn't gotten a call back. And they called me back after I had already called back and talked to somebody and waited a half hour. So the first time I phoned to the time where I actually got my power hooked up was like, two and a half three hours anyway happy we're gonna go see crystals i need to get gas first because it's on the other side of the city but gas crystals and then panda express oh my god have i expressed how excited i am to have panda express i thought it was just a states thing and i found out like a week ago that it's in calgary y'all i had that in vegas and i swear i ate it like three times the week i was there so freaking good i oh, i'm so excited to go um so that's the plan yeah i'll see you at the at the um why can't i think of words i'll see you at the crystal show <laughs> Okay, so I've been here for like an hour and a half and I've already I've already bought from three different booths and like there's so much more to look at.
I had to stop. I was getting. Oh, I had to stop. I was getting so hungry. So I got this pasta salad, a diet Pepsi. This is all my goodies so far from the biggest vendor. Literally, the energy in this building is so strong. Like, it's a good thing, but like, also, like, I need to get used to it. Clearly, I have a lot of negative energy in my life. Okay, so this is everything that I got for myself. So I got some chakra bath bombs. So each bath bomb has um, a crystal to align with your chakra. That's what they're called. I then got this really cute cloud. I've been looking for a cloud um, crystal forever. And everything was so decently priced. I got a little piggy. This is, I believe, a Caribbean calcite. I believe this is a fluorite. And then I got this keychain, which I'll actually put on my keys right now. It is a Oco geode. <laughs> and I got this really pretty star. I love crystals with little druzies like this. And there's another one kind of up in here right there. So there's a bigger one there, a bigger one there, and a little one there. Um, this is a yellow calcite. I don't know why, but I was just drawn to it. And they say if you're drawn to crystals to get them. A clear quartz moon I think is really pretty. I need to take the sticker off the back, but I love anything moon related. I then got another Caribbean calcite and it goes with this card. So it's stone of forgiveness and self-acceptance. It helps in deep emotional healing and liberation. Powerful aid against sadness and depression. I then got this cherry blossom agate, which I think is absolutely stunning. And it evokes a sense of comfort and knowing it will all be okay. It also has a calming healing energy. It reminds us that growth takes time and gives patience so we can blossom. I really like it, especially this blue side. I then got a Botswana agate for myself, as well as both my parents, but I'll show theirs later. This one has to be my favorite. The pink argonite. Again, obsessed with the little dressies. I'm obsessed with this. Um, a pink argonite is said to be attuned with earth goddess encouraging conversation and cons conserva conservation and respect to nature. It helps with geopathic and emotional stress, brings a sense of order and courage to one's life. So th that's everything I got for myself. Um, I then got a couple of items for one of my friends back home. There are two items that I cannot show on YouTube without being flagged. Um, use your imagination. I got her, well, she paid me for these. Pretty decently sized skull. And then this one, neither of us had heard of. It is, um, pink dolomite. It's not really pink in real life. It's more like a light brown. And then she got two mini mushrooms. And I'll just I don't know how to, no, I can't I can't show those without being flagged. Got me and my dad and my brother got her this little turtle green aventurine for Mother's Day. And then got both of my parents a Botswana agate. 
I have the Crystal Bibles from, um, I'll put the author up on the screen now, um, but I was reading, um, the Crystal Bible and I don't, I can't remember what these are good for, but whatever they are, I put a note in my phone that it'd be good for me and my parents. And then my grandma asked me to get something for her for my great grandma. So for Mother's Day. So my grandma is giving my great grandma this Chevron Amethyst. And this Clear Quartz Heart. This is everything I got today. These are all for me. I am obsessed and I cannot wait to go back to this fest er, festival to this show next time it is in town. That is it for today's video though, you guys. I I, I think I have more than enough footage. Um, tomorrow, all I'm doing is packing up my Airbnb. Maybe I'll throw a tour in. You know what? Hmm. We'll see. If I feel like throwing an Airbnb tour, I will put that in now. Okay, so I quickly decided just to do a quick little tour. So I'm at the entryway right now. As my brother likes to joke, it looks like I'm having a party because I have so many shoes. Right to your right is the bathroom. The one thing I didn't like about this bathroom is that there was no storage. So like all of my stuff is on the sink counter. And then this is what it looks like your typical bathroom, really small. Then I really like these mirrors right at the entryway. I don't know, I thought they were cute. And then this is like a, it's like a coat closet that has a bunch of the cleaning stuff. That's another thing, this place doesn't have much storage. Um, I never used it. And then the first bedroom was like the guest bedroom I used. So I'll just do a quick little pan over because I never really stayed in here. I used to have my stuff, like my extra suitcases and stuff filled with my stuff because I never really unpacked. That's the thing with me is I don't unpack if the place is not mine. So I had like my suitcases laid out on this bed the last weekend my entire family came to visit. So I they're now on my floor, you will see. Um, the closet's over there. So you walk out and you're right in the kitchen. So that's where we were. Bedroom, entryway, bathroom, kitchen. The kitchen is really nice. Do a little pan over. And I'm gonna... So then the living room is just... It don't mind me and my cat on that blanket. Um, I was supposed to have my dad and my dad's friend over this weekend because they were gonna help me move but now it's just my dad so he'll just sleep in the spare bedroom but um tv plants that tall plant was on the table over there quick little shout out to my crystals over here can you spot the new ones i have so many i'm gonna make them look really nice at my new place um and then there is a balcony right there i'm not gonna open the door but you get the picture this is where oh i completely skipped over a closet this is the laundry and there's clothes in the dryer which i cannot forget about um so this is where i've been staying um as you can see these suitcases are full of stuff um because i don't unpack um fan which was haunted, if you know, you know, um, over there, <laughs> all my vitamins. But this is just a pan over of the room. And then the closet was a pretty decent size, but that is the tour. Um, if not, that is it for today's video, you guys. I hope you did enjoy. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps me in the YouTube algorithm. And make sure you're subscribed. Turn on your bell notification. I, I hear people say that all the time on YouTube. So why not do it? Um, 
that is it for today's video. I hope you did enjoy. I will see you guys next video. Bye.